We'll begin with breaking news from Detroit's west side where a house has collapsed and there may be someone trapped in the rubble. Good to have you with us tonight at 11. We've just learned that house caught fire months ago. And tonight firefighters are looking for a person who may have been inside the house before it collapsed. Tim Pamplin is there on the scene with the night cam. Tim? Detroit Fire Department search and rescue squad on the scene here. This is uh, Genesee and Joy, Detroit's west side. The house standing one minute, collapsed the next. It was standing, one piece of it fell down before we left. And then when we got back, it was all the way down. Neighbors say they saw the man living in here the last couple of days. It was an abandoned home. Then this afternoon, they saw the man go inside the house, but he never came out. He's got a buggy over there in the alley. What sort of a buggy? Grocery cart, you know, scrapping. Scrap buggies must be in there scrapping. Pulled the wrong piece of metal and the whole thing collapsed. Firefighters spending all evening out here, very gingerly moving the debris, understanding that this man could still be inside here, injured. Hopefully they don't find him. I'm hoping he got out of there. Lord Jesus. So back here, Michigan State Police cadaver dog has been to the scene. It's a little too dangerous for them to get in there right now. The firefighters and heavy equipment will remain until this house is fully picked apart. That's the scene on the west side tonight with a night cam. Tim Pamplin, local for.